Hi guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, let's learn a Python program that is uh, write a Python program to remove the nth index character from a non-empty string. So given a string as input to the Python program and given the index value, so you have to remove the nth index character from a given string. So that is a problem statement. So let's try to solve this. So I'll be taking three variables. First is string variable to store the input string. Then next is index variable to store the index. And the third variable is a output string. So let's use a, a variable to skip the, that is to remove the nth index character and store the string. So I'll be using, that is a third variable. So let's use it. So let me take input underscore text and use the input function call to ask a user to enter a string. Yeah, so once the user enters a string, so it will be stored in this input text variable. So now let's take another variable that is index and uh, let's use input function call and uh, ask a user to enter an index. Yeah, so once the user enters an index, so let's use a type conversion. So it will be of type string. So I'll be converting it to an integer. So once we are done with input and index, so let's take output underscore text to store the output string and initialize it to an empty string. Yeah, so once we are done with the input or variable declaration, so let's use a if statement to check if the, that is the index is less than the length of the input text, that is input string so that uh, the index value should not exceed the input text length. So if the index is less than the length of the input text, so then what you do is you have to use the for loop to iterate all the letters present in the input string and skip the nth index character and keep adding it to the output text. So let's use enumerate function to get the index that is for i. So this is the index value and also I need a letter in let's use a enumerate function to enumerate the input text. Yeah, so once we enumerate and get the index as well as letter. So let's check if index is equal equals to the user entered index value so then what you do is you just use a continue statement that is in order to skip the or remove the nth index character that is if the index is equals to the user entered index so then what you do is just skip the letter so else what you do is just add the letter to the output text so let me take output text and plus equals to the letter. Yeah, so this is the code to skip the or remove the nth index character from a given string and at the end of the for loop, so let's take a print statement. So let's use uh, some statement that is a string after removing the nth index character is let's give colon and let's directly print the output text. Yeah, so let's take an else block again and uh, here let's print an invalid index entered. So this is a else block of this if statement. We are checking if index is less than the length of input text. So now let's say you entered an invalid index Let's give some exclamation mark. Yeah, so this is a complete Python program to remove the nth index character from a non-empty string. So let me execute this and let me show you how it works. So let's say hello. So this is my string and I want to remove the third index character. 
So you can see the string after removing the nth index character is hello, that is L has been removed. Let me execute it again. And now let's give something like remove and let's give index as something like seven. So you can see it has the index is uh, greater than the length of the string. So you can see you entered an invalid index error message has been printed. Let me execute it again. And let's say remove. And let me give sixth index. So again you can see the length is uh, greater than the string length. Let me run it again and let's say remove and I have to remove the fifth index. So you can see the string after removing the nth index character is removed. Yes, yeah, so this is a complete Python program to remove the nth index character from a given string. So I'll give this code in the description of this video. So that's it in this video. Hope you liked it. Thank you for watching. Bye.